think it's a fascinating book. Uh, and it, it strikes me that while it's true it may have been dreamt up by the British, it's become a nightmare for the United States. Uh, and it's a nightmare because everybody in Washington knows what the reality is of Saudi rule, and they know that the money from the oil comes in to Saudi Arabia, to Red, is redistributed to radical Islamists, not only uh, within Saudi, but much more commonly abroad, to keep the problem abroad. And so, in a sense, Saudi Arabia has become this tr tr channel for money to flow to the most radical elements, uh, Wahhabist elements in Islam, and political Islam all over the world is financed this way. But what can the Americans do? Because there's a, a worse alternative, isn't there, which, which haunts the United States, namely of the Islamic Republic of Arabia, the Saudi, the Saudi royal family overthrown the 3,000 or 4,000 or 5,000 princes take to their heels end up in the south of France, and you have an Iranian-style regime, only it's Wahhabist, uh, uh, an Islamic Republic like that would be surely the ultimate nightmare of American well, foreign policy.